can, can I get some water? All right, guys, so check this out, man. I seen a video where, and it was a recent video. It was a recent video where um, ex-president Barack Obama was in Michigan. He was in Flint, Michigan, and he was giving one of his talks, one of his rallies, and he did something, you know, as a, as a, I guess, he was trying to do a stunt to let the people of Flint, Michigan know that he was with them 100%. He tried to drink some of their water. He literally, while he was giving his speech, he asked for some water. And he said he didn't want a bottle of water. He said, I want a glass of water. And watch what happens in this video because, and please don't pay attention to my ugly face on it. You see my mug right there. I look ridiculous. Um, but on this video right here, I want y'all to see this because this one right here is freaking nuts. It's nuts, okay? Because President Barack Obama, ex-president, is going to try to show people that he is down, but watch what the people of, of Michigan do, man. Watch this. And please don't look at my face. Forget my face. My face is ridiculous sometimes. Okay, here we go. Uh, can, can I get some water? Come on up there. I want a glass of water. Y'all hear him? The people in the crowd are saying, get a bottle of water. Don't get a glass, get a bottle. And if you look at the bottom of the video right here, they are actually showing some information about Flint, Michigan at the time, and they're showing the color of their water and everything. See, that's why y'all got to go to bluemonsterprep.com and make sure y'all stock up on y'all water and filtration um, systems over there. And make sure you put in code LFR because this right here is happening a lot and it's not only happening in Michigan it's, it's in Baltimore too it's in a lot of places so y'all need to make sure y'all are good you and your families okay listen to this he's asking the people in Flint Michigan for a glass of water and watch what happens I want, I want a glass of water everybody settle down this is a feisty crowd look at the pipes y'all see the pipes down below I don't know if, it's, if this is big enough but right here Y'all see that right there? Y'all see how nasty those things look? This is the water. And y'all see the faces of the people out there in the stands looking at him while he, at, while he goes to drink water? They don't think this is funny. They, they, they're looking at this like, bruh, why are you playing games right now? Look at their faces. They're like, dude, you're playing games right now. a glass of water this is not a stunt what he yeah so that did he drink any did he drink any he wet his lips he did not drink it he didn't sip it he wet his lips there was an audible yeah i heard that right he did not drink it he did that as a stunt he said he wanted some water he asked them to go get some water because he wanted to he wanted to rile them up and let him know that i'm with y'all <laughs> See, this is why I don't trust politicians, man. Y'all get on my dag on nerves. But all the all the poli y'all get on my nerves. Oh, gasp in the audience. People were just like absolutely dejected. And then when you look at the glass, they did not put that glass in front of a dag on faucet and get him any. They put they put some water in the glass, all right. But they got that water from a dag on uh a nice, fancy, um, sealed bottle. Ain't no way in the world they went ahead and said, okay, he said he wanted glass. So he said, somebody get him a glass. Put it under the faucet. No, that did not happen, man. Why would you do that? I, I am sure that somewhere when I was two years old, I was taking a chip of paint tasting it and i got some lead yeah that's like talking about like well i didn't wear a seatbelt and i'm fine it's like but there were tons of people that died yep and 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 a lot of people that are in the audience right now are like dude what the hell are you doing man why is it is this supposed to be motivational encouraging inspirational am i should i be inspired to go 
eat lead paint? What what are you saying? Backstage, the president sitting at the table with the criminal governor all good. All decided set. to perform his stunt all, all over again. You know, generally I have not been doing stunts here, but you know <laughs> That's not what I expected. He did it again? He did it twice. Yo, he did not do it twice. That's what Snyder did. It felt like he minimized like what people were actually going through and struggling with. If you were actually lead poisoned, you would not be president. You would be janitor Barack Obama. We were holding on to hope that he would declare a disaster area. A disaster would give us FEMA. It would give us pipe replacement, get engineers in, a, in here. Then we could get Medicare for all the residents of Flint. As soon as he took a drink of the water and said everything's fine, that was that. Was that. And look at it, years later, it's still poison. When he came here, it was my president. But when he left, he was not my president. Wow. Bruh, that hurt my heart a little bit, man. Because I didn't watch the video that far. That, that, that hurt my heart, man. Because he only went just to do the stunt on camera, man. That's it. I, I'm going there, and while I'm talking to the people, oh, yeah, I'm going to ask for a cup of water. Who wrote that in the speech? It couldn't have been you. Who suggested that? Fire them. Oh, my gracious, that's just ridiculous. And then when you're sitting down with everyone around the table, you pull the same freaking stunt. You say, give me a glass of water. Somebody give me a glass of water because I'm from Detroit. Huh? I'm from Chicago. Is he from Chicago? Was he from? I don't know where he's from. But that that whole scheme, it lacked any honor. It lacked honor, man. They believed in I you. would, again, go back to the president's visit last week. He reinforced the message that filtered water has been determined to be safe for people to drink. This, again, was our hero, and we thought he was going to come here and help us. But they do have a mural of him, and D-Rye has it now, and his head is busted out. If he would have said that this was a national emergency, they would have gave them some FEMA money so that they can fix their piping and have clear water. All he had to say was, this is an emergency. They need water, and they would have gotten it. But he didn't say it. My only question is, why didn't he say it? Why wasn't this a part of his whole trip there? People like to make fun. people always like to show videos of when Donald Trump went to Puerto Rico and he was throwing um, paper towels to people almost like he was shooting the ball, like shooting. He was shooting paper towels at them after a, a hurricane or a tornado or something like that. And they was acting like that was the worst thing they've ever seen in their lives. What's the difference between this and, and this stunt right here? This right here is even worse. All he had to do was say it. And they would have had the money to do what they need to do. It was devastating. That's crazy, man. That is crazy. Listen, bro. At the end of the day, we need to stop giving so much praise to these people who do not have your best interest at heart. They don't have it. They don't have your best interest in mind or in their hearts. It's all about them and their families. That's it. This is their career. For the most part, their constituents don't mean anything to them. That's unfortunate because I was a huge fan of then President Barack Obama. Huge fan. I didn't pay attention to his policies. I didn't care less. I cared less to look at his policies. I didn't want to hear about his policies. And when people brought him up and they attacked him, I'd be ready to fight. I wouldn't be ready to fight, but I'd be ready to argue. And I wouldn't know what I'm talking about. This was disgraceful because you got a whole bunch of people there that believe in you. They think that, oh, he's coming here. Something's about to happen. He's about to say it's a national emergency and we about to get the money we need to fix our water. And people will not have to boil their waters. And, and like, do you know how difficult you're making it on people? But come on, man, I ain't even going to get into that. I thought that was disgusting. And that was, that lacked taste. Like, that was horrible. <laughs> but that's just me. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments, man. Love y'all.
Sheesh. That was crazy, bro.